What's poppin' homies? It's your favorite homegirl, Gossip Girl, and today we're gonna get into this drama with Ray Shonda and La Chandra from TikTok, okay? I'm not sure how many of you over here are over there down to the TikTok, but that's where you need to be because, honey, they not peach in her family business out of the algorithm, and it's nothing but um, La Chandra and Ray Shonda down the line. So I'm just going to give you guys a brief, okay, a brief discussion on what's going on because it's a lot. Now, last night I caught the live because I'm always, I, I always miss out on things. But last night I caught the live of Ray Shonda, right? And she was just breaking it down because some people thought that, you know, the reason why they had broke up or they was getting a divorce because, you know, she lost, you know, she lost weight and she was feeling herself. And yes, I thought so too. But baby, when I listened to that live stream that she gave last night, I was like, oh, baby, she was exposing. She was exposing LaShondra, honey. So any ill thought that I had on my part, I am sorry because nobody should be going through what she went through with LaShondra. And it seemed like after one person was telling her, what LaShondra was doing, it seemed like the gates opened and all of the mess came flooding down. Okay? The walls came tumbling down. So basically what, what was going on is LaShondra and Ray Shonda are were, were evicted out of their home. Okay? LaShondra didn't pay the rent. And, and she wasn't paying the bills either. So where was all this money going? All right? So now they gotta leave. And oh Lord, talking about betrayal. Mm. So now they gotta leave. So Ray Shonda is staying with her best friend at her best friend's house. Little Chandra, she's a property manager for some apartment complex. So she might be staying in one of those apartments or she might be staying with her mother. I'm not too sure about that. So Rayshonda was saying how she borrowed a thousand dollars from her friends. Okay. She eventually gave that thousand dollars back. But see, Rayshonda didn't know any of this. She had borrowed a thousand dollars from her friends. Right? Then her business partner, well, her friend was telling her that LaShondra didn't pay her for the Airbnb where her bishop was staying. Okay? So she reached out to the bishop. She, they had receipts showing that they paid LaShondra for, you know, for the Airbnb. Another Bishop told Ray Chandra how LaShondra was stealing from the church. She was stealing the church's money. It's a lot. You will find all of this on TikTok. It is just so much of it. Whew. Um, LaShondra had took out a loan and she had convinced Ray Shonda to, you know, co-sign on it. Well, she find out that the loan, she defaulted on the loan. So now that's going to be on Ray Shonda's credit report. So this whole thing right now that's going on between Ray Shonda and LaShondra, it looks like LaShondra was scamming. And then when you get on TikTok, you're going to find other live streams where somebody got up on another live stream and said how LaShondra was cheating on Ray Shonda. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. But baby, TikTok has been on and popping. To the point they not peached out of the one out of the number one spot, which I'm kind of glad 
but this 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 drama is just ridiculous and i feel bad for i really do feel bad for Rashonda because nobody deserves that type of betrayal somebody you laying down with and talking to and sleeping with and all this kind of stuff are doing you wrong behind your back and everything that was happening her friends was telling her well you know this is what's happening and nobody told her why it happened but after this news got out and they told and she was talking to her friends and she told them what happened a lot of stuff has been exposed about LaShondra so if you want to deep dive into this drama head on over to TikTok and just type in Rayshondra Rayshonda and LaShondra because baby is a whole lot it's a whole lot I just feel so bad for Rayshonda right now and I also feel bad for LaShondra's son, Devin. Is it Devin or Devon? I feel bad for him because he seems like he's a sweet kid. You know what I'm saying? And to hear his mother in all this mess, I know it has to bother him in some type of way. But baby, the folks on LaShondra's side, oh, they want to they wanna get on her real bad. They ready to tax her real good. But, whew, it's a lot. It's a whole lot. So y'all go ahead and go over there and get into that drama. And I'll talk to you later.